Hi there. This is your January Love Tarot Cards reading by Emma for all singles and unattached Aries people. Alright, we're going to have four cards and from there, the Emperor. Five of Pentacles. Eight of Wands. And Strength for the month of January 2021. Eight of Swords, you're influencing energy, you are stuck in a situation, um, very single, all right, and you don't like it anymore, kind of, you feel that you're responsible because you are single, because you guarded yourself so much, not to get hurt, so you didn't even want to see opportunity, another person, even good or bad, whatever it is, you didn't want to see opportunity for you. You didn't want to say to yourself that you are stuck in that situation because, I don't know, you have children, you are too busy, you are afraid to get hurt. And, and that's why you are single. You didn't even want it to move out of that situation. You, you didn't want to acknowledge that there is a problem, you know, that you feel lonely, that you feel stuck. You didn't want it to see it. The Emperor with Wheel of Fortune. Good. Five of Pentacles with Eight of Pentacles. Eight of Wands with the World. And Strength with a Page of Pentacles. No, Page of Wands. No, Aries, you're influencing energy. It perhaps comes from December or something earlier where you realize that what I told you about Eight of Swords that you got yourself into that situation of being stuck as a single person and, and you realize it's, it's kind of your fault. I mean, it's not blame now. It's nothing like that. I mean, it is perhaps responsibility towards, towards your parents, towards your children or whatever that was for you. You are single. You kind of felt that you cannot even meet people because you got all day long some sort of obligation. There's no place for you maybe to go out and to meet another person working at home, you know, looking after your children. You, you just don't have they just don't have a chance to meet another person. Just that sort of situation. A page of ones within you. It's that eagerness to move out. You are out suddenly. Somehow you are visible. You're out. You want to meet people. People, where are you? <laughs> you see with page of ones. That kind of eagerness, that kind of happiness to be out there now. Finally, you're out there, visible, you want to meet people. Nobody is there right now, okay? Nobody was there in December, but you are ready to change yourself. And first week of January says you are putting structure for your life in a different way. Maybe you are meeting somebody who is Aries as well, but I really think that is not that you are meeting person at that point. It's just that you are changing yourself. You are putting structure in your life. You want a different life, different self. Different self, Wheel of Fortune, you made, you made your decision. You are changing. Now, you change yourself in a sense. Now, you decided you would like to have a relationship. You would like to have somebody on your side. You would like to have your soulmate. And even if it's not soulmate, you want to meet another, to have good time with another person. You know, somebody who is just for you. I think that's why you do have this emperor that you, you're supposed to actually change your life, change your structure in your life. Now, you are not going to be all the time at home. You will go to the pub. You will go to, I don't know, and places where people meet. You will go hiking with other people. You'll change your life so you can meet people, so you can be with other people, so you can get into this surrounding, <laughs> into the places with people, so you can meet another one. You know, could be just something like that. Or you're just changing your mentality. You are changing structure within yourself. And you said, from now on, I would love to communicate with people. I would make myself approachable to other people. You see what I'm saying? You are changing. I'll dress differently. Change my style. Make myself more attractive. Even just like that. Or all of it. That is your first week. Very major decision. Very major decision. You want to be out there. You want to be available. And for people to see you. Yes, you are available now. 
Now, second week is about pentacles, is about all this money, all this manifestation, your work, your job. Maybe you are um, maybe you are presenting yourself now in the outer world with your work, right? With your skill work. In that sense, you are now visible. With your work, with your skill, all right? It's not your uh, physical appearance, it's your work. That's how you put yourself up front, so you're visible. You see what I'm saying? Somehow with Five of Pentacles, you found yourself in that um, unwanted position, all right? Somehow you didn't earn much, okay? Or um, you didn't get position that you wanted to get you were not in the place you wanted to find yourself in. You see what I'm saying? With that work, that, that work was something on your mind that you thought it's going to bring you up front, it's going to bring you visible, but somehow it brought you in a kind of situation that you didn't want to be. You planned something, but you ended up in a different way, in a different place. People were seeing different than that what you thought, that what you expected that you're going to be seen like. You see what I'm saying? You put your effort, you put your work there. Um, you show yourself with your work, but somehow people are seeing you as a poor person. You know, like somebody who's, maybe they, they see you as a gold digger. Maybe, maybe you expected people to see you as a quality, uh, hardworking person. Instead, it's, they, they saw you in, in a completely different way. Something like that. This is this harmony in that what you wanted for yourself. You wanted for yourself to be seen as a hard-working, capable person. Somehow people saw you in a completely different way. People saw you as a just poor one, as a victim type of person. And, you know, in a very, in a completely different way. And it doesn't make you happy. You don't like it. You absolutely don't like it but you will change all right it's it's kind of process that when you put yourself out there you want to be visible you that what you choose for yourself that's the way how you're going to present yourself in the outer world with your skill that what you trust as a quality that you can rely on when you put yourself out there in the world visible that people about to see your quality uh, as a hard-working, capable person, um, with a person with a good skill, you know, with lots of knowledge. But you ended up being seen in a different way. Doesn't matter, gossip, whatever people did, for whatever reason. Um, I did notice that we do have three eights. Now, eight is a very auspicious number. It's expansive one. You know, you want more, you want better, you want more freedom, you want more skill, you want more money for yourself, you want to be better, um, more freedom for yourself. More exposure for yourself. Eight of Wands, you want to communicate. You are exposing yourself. You are communicating. Everything is in the air. Change is there because the world within you, you are kind of closing down on some situation in your life. Will and Fortune, the world, third week of January. Something that is within you is still there. Kind of reminiscence of something that is old. You want to change for yourself. You have to change your realization. It's over. You are not going anymore with, with that what you were. Single person looking after the children, do um, house chores or do this work at home or not communicating with people, being concentrated only on making money, only on studying. Do you want to change that? And that expansive energy, everything in the air. It is lots of communication. You might communicate with people, maybe even with people overseas. You might planning to travel the world. This indicates travel. You know, maybe that you are now interested in other cultures, in other people. People from different backgrounds, from people from different countries, from different religions, different, different, something different from some totally different part of the world. But could be just in a process in that sense. That you are dramatically changing your world, your approach to your world, dramatically changing in a completely different way. From now on, you're expanding your horizons. You are open for whatever comes your way. Doesn't matter culture, it doesn't matter religion, it doesn't matter skin color. You see what I'm saying? You are now, at this point, open to meet somebody. Somebody, somebody that you're gonna like. Somebody that you're gonna love. Somebody who's gonna like you, care about you. You see, you've got different standards now. 
you are opening yourself to this outer world. Lovely. I mean, and my impression is that this January for you single area is going to be just that decision, that major decision that you are putting yourself out there. And it's the whole thing is, a, the whole January is about it. You will be like certain at one moment. Another moment you're not certain are you doing it the right way. You're facing the, the, the obstacles, you know, which is the right way. But the general sense of your, of your decision and that, that you are changing yourself, you are putting yourself out there, you are available, you want another one, is kind of that what will dominate, that sense of you changing yourself and make yourself more available. Strength, energy, page of pentacles. I think by the end of the month, you are there. You are there knowing what you want. You're very young energy with page of pentacles. It says, you will go kindly, um, patiently into this outer world. Strength energy just confirms that. Whatever came your way as obstacle or um, unpleasant situation or maybe gossip or, you, you know, whatever that you will be facing once you put yourself visible out there, you know, you will perhaps face... Uh, um, different comments, different approaches now towards you. You see what I'm saying? But now you are not giving up your decision to be out there and to find somebody for yourself, not to be single anymore, is there. You, the page of pentacles says you are on that path. You will kindly, patiently carry on on your new path. You are a different person. You made yourself approachable. You made yourself available. You are very certain with it. And you will not rush. It is important that this may be true love. It is important that you find maybe kind person. You know, you brought your new mentality into it. You made yourself different. And you are not giving up. All right, whatever it is, you will go through with it. You are from now single, single person and available and Aries, I wish you good luck and enjoy it.